today I'm going to show you how to create a little lanyard for your belt loop uh, carrier keys. So basically this would clip into your, your belt loop like that and then you have a piece coming off here with your keys hanging on it off the key ring. Um, real easy to do. I've got about four feet of each color here, purple and yellow. I have fused them in the middle already. Um, what you're going to do is just put it right through the uh, center of the carabiner. You've got your loop here. Reach through the loop. Grab hold of the two and pull them through so you get a nice loop right like that. And then thread the uh, paracord through the key ring. And this is where you're going to choose how long you want to make it. But for about four feet of paracord, it'll give you about four inches every inch for the, uh, we're doing the para or the uh, cobra weave, so for every inch that you want of a finished product, that's how many feet of paracord you're going to need per side. Okay, so I'm going to say I want it to be about this long here. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to start the uh, cobra weave and whichever one that you start going over the top that's the one that you want to continue to go the rest of the way so if I start like this with yellow on top I'm going to make your loop cross the two middle ones and cross your purple one over the yellow like that let me lay this down so you can get an idea how that looks just like that and then take the purple go behind all three and pull it up through that loop like that and pull it tight and you can adjust your length and make sure this one's nice and tight because this is going to be more and more difficult further down you go to adjust the length all right so we did yellow on top so we're just going to continue to do yellow on top yellow on top cross the purple go behind everything and up through that loop Yellow on top, purple crosses behind through the loop, pull it nice and tight. Same thing. So the two colors of paracord I have here, these are both 100 foot uh, sections. The mainly green one there, that's Digital Viper. It's part of our military collection on our website. And the other one, the multicolor with the uh, green, red, and yellow, that's also part of our military collection and that is called Vietnam Vet. Um, I thought I would you know, pull out a couple of the military ones just because this weekend is Veterans Weekend and I am a veteran, so why not? Now the, uh, the carabiner and the, uh, the keychain, those are two items that I, I do plan on putting on the website. Um, I do have them right now available. I just haven't gotten around to taking pictures and getting them up there yet. But they are available. If you need any, just let me know. gets to be a little bit harder and harder as further down you get just because you run out of room so what you can do I'll show you here in a second you can actually push up just to give you a little bit of room and then you can kind of pull it back down to fill it in fill that little gap in yeah see like that now if I take and I 
hold the, hold the carabiner and I can push up and it kind of gives me a little more room. You get that one. I might be able to get one more. Yeah, it looks like I can. You want to fill it up as much as you can. It just looks better if there's not, you know, two strands sticking out and then the beginning of the, the paracord bracelet part. Or in this case, the lanyard. Alright, so now that we got that, then you can kind of pull this down a little bit to fill it all in. And the final step, I, just, I, I like to use a piece of paper because I have in the past accidentally, uh, when, I, when I've been cutting this and melting the ends, I accidentally dropped it and it really it put a black spot right on my table, so I try to protect that as much as I can now. Just cut that as close to the, the edge as you can. A little bit of hangover isn't too much, or isn't too bad I should say. And you're going to want to use the low part of the flame so that you don't burn the paracord. You just want to melt it enough to where you can push this on there and it kind of fuses everything right in. See that? That's how you finish that. And then you do the same thing on the other side. Now what did this take? Maybe five minutes to make? This would be a great gift. Um, come Christmas time or just something fun to make maybe with some, some of your friends or something like that too so that's nicely melted and I'm just going to use the edge of the metal part if you use the plastic part of your lighter it'll stick because plastic on plastic it tends to fuse together you can kind of see it did that to me right here and there you have it that is a keychain lanyard for your belt loop um, that is the, the uh, Cobra Weave. If you have any questions about it, let me know. Don't forget to hit my subscribe button. And check out all of our products on boardparacord.com. Thank you.